you got the best places to find work in America. I am Enrico Moretti and I've been working on the economics of cities for 15 years now. If you look at America today, you don't see one country, you see three increasingly different countries. On one end, you have cities like San Francisco, Seattle, Austin, with a strong innovation base, economy and a workforce that is one of the most creative in the globe. At the other extreme, you see cities like Detroit, Flint, or Cleveland that are struggling and are losing population. And in the middle, there is the rest of the country. It seems undecided on which direction to take. It's really up to us to decide whether we want an America that keeps innovating and keeps creating great jobs that, that are creative and pay good wages, or an America of shrinking population, falling wages, and declining productivity. There's a growing disparity between the cities that are innovating and the cities that are not innovating. And the key fundamental factor that determines which cities are doing well and which cities are struggling is the average level of education of the workforce. Cities that have a very well-educated workforce keep attracting innovative employers and keep attracting even more skilled workers. Not everybody can work for Google, Apple, or the latest biotech startup. But the growth of jobs in the innovation sector matters to all of us. And I'm talking about jobs like real estate agents or hairdressers, uh, policemen, doctors, lawyers, nurses. All these jobs are ultimately supported by jobs in, in the high tech sector. Choosing the right city and where you live is one of the most important choices that you can make.